Hello guys, I'm back again with another video. Actually, I made it last time which entitled, Home Egg Series Sequential Number on Coupons using Adobe Photoshop. But today I'm gonna show you another trick. Instead of making individual coupons and then arrange it individually for printing, this time, we'll make all this task in one method. We will be making series number that already arrange and ready for printing. Ok let's start. Let's go to our Photoshop. Just like before make a document size for example is 11 inches for the width and 8.5 inches for the height. I have a sample coupon here from my client. Coupon size is 5 inches width and 2.5 inches height. Ok let's arrange it here. We have 6 coupons in one document. We'll assume this as C1, C2, C3, C4, C5, C6. This make us guide in making our series numbers. Now open Excel. Input the 6 values, from C1 to C6 for example 18 series numbers for each coupon. Just continue the last number. Save it in CSV file. Don't forget to close the Excel file before importing it to Photoshop. Back to our Photoshop. Let's name numbers in coupons like num1. Num2 up to num6. Okay, let's define the variables. Go to Image, Variables, select Define. Inputting the values for text replacement, just follow the values we made in the Excel, it should be the same. Import the data sets from the CSV file. Go to Image, Variables, Select Data Sets. Now data sets were imported here from C1 values to C6.
OK, let's export the datasets as file. Go to File, Export, Dataset as Files. OK, select Folder Location to save. OK, now let's convert these files into JPEG. Go to File, Scripts, Image Processor. Select the source. Select Save in the same location. And run. Yes, we've done it. Very easy. This is only an example. You can correct the numbers, sizes and colors if you want. And okay, that's all. Hope it helped you. Thank you for watching. And please help me grow this channel by smashing that subscribe button. And hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of my future uploads. Thank you and to God be the glory.